Hawaii Senator Richard Luger gave his colleagues what he termed his valedictory speech and warned them about the dangers of excessive partisanship. Luger said Congress is not living up to the expectations of Americans. RTV6 reporter Norman Cox has more on the speech for us. Norman. Luger told his fellow senators today that he is optimistic about the country's future and both internal divisions and external threats can be overcome. But he warned it will require Americans and their leaders to find common ground with others who have a different vision. Richard Luger wrapped up 36 years in the Senate by telling his fellow members that none of them is above politics, nor should they be. But he also said they should be, quote, aspiring to something greater than this. It is possible to be elected and reelected again and again and uh, gain prominence in the Senate while giving very little thought to governance. One can even gain considerable notoriety by devoting one's career to the political aspects of a senator's job, namely promoting the party line, raising money, focusing on public relations. Responsibility for legislative shortcomings can be pinned on the other party or even intractable members of one's own party. Luger said lawmakers often fail to listen to each other, and he took a thinly veiled shot at the pledge many have given to lobbyist Grover Norquist to never raise taxes. Too often in recent years, members of Congress have locked themselves into a slate of inflexible positions many of which have no hope of being implemented in a divided government. And some of these positions have been further calcified by pledges signed for political purposes. Luger's Indiana colleague Dan Coates praised him for his long service. Coates said Luger has a unique talent for building coalitions and bringing people together to accomplish great things. I'm Norman Cox, RTV6.